Hey everybody, 49. So um I just got an email, right? About well not an email, uh TikTok DM. Oh, I'm drinking another one of my um daddy 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 daddy. It's bit off. I had to let it cool off a little bit. So um <clears throat> yeah, I just got a uh TikTok DM asking me if I'm a feminist. So I wanna break, I wanna break this down. So I'm not a feminist. Feminism is not for me. It's not for anybody that's black, brown, or indigenous. That just wasn't what it was for. So I want to talk about because they made a comment about the Roe versus Wade thing. So I'm going to be this. I don't please do not think that I'm crazy or anything. I just do. I believe everything is a hidden agenda. There's a motive behind everything that happens in the U.S. of A. Everything. There's a motive behind something. I don't think the police are here to do what they're supposed to do. I don't think government works the way they the way we think it works. None of that. None of that. That's why I always Google, re not even Google research. I be all over, all over just researching stuff, right? Check it out. How I honestly feel and what I feel to be is true is this, is that it, it, it is an agenda behind Roe versus Wade. What I know that is this, is that I feel like they're trying to overturn this because they want white, white women to have more babies. And you'd be like, damn, Alexis, where the hell you got that from? Boom. And the fact checkers are out there. So if I'm wrong, correct me. What I'm saying is this, when you... When you research it, the amount of, of 60%, 6 percent of white women get abortions. Woo! Now y'all think, y'all think, oh, how you know that? What you know? The fact checkers are out there. I'm telling you, 60% of the women that get abortions are white women. 60, 6, 0. It's not black, black. It's not brown. It's not indigenous. No, no, -uh, mm -mm, no. You just, th oh, people always think it's us because that's all you see. You see the Planned Parenthood sign. You got a Spanish lady and a black lady. Like, oh, we're going to do it. You understand what I'm saying? No, no, no. No, no, no. 60% of the, of the women that get abortions are white women. Okay? Boom. Check it out. Another thing. The Feminism Act had nothing to do with black, brown, or, or indigenous women. It just did not. It did not include us. What is this lady's name? My laptop. Both the laptops are, uh, um, are dead. Um, What is this lady's name? Come on. Come on. What's her name? What's her name? What's this white lady's name? Um, I want to say Susan B. Anthony. The fact checkers are out there to check me. Susan. I want to say it was Susan B. Anthony. That wasn't for us. Do you know? I'm about to hit y'all with something that y'all don't even know. A lot of people may not know. Do you know that... 40% of slave owners were white women? <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Feminism wasn't about us. It, had, it did not include us. We weren't even looked at as people. We were like, what, one third of a property or something? The fact checkers are out there. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Don't jump on this bandwagon. If you're jumping on a bandwagon, understand what you're jumping on. Understand what you're jumping on. Understand what you do. Feminist nothing. Oh, you're a feminist? Hell no. I'm not a feminist. I believe in pussy power. I don't like your vagina. And all of that. But I'm not a feminist. That had nothing to do with us. It didn't include black people, brown people, indigenous people. It did not. It's the truth. Those white women were monsters. Some still are. Don't get me. Don't get me. I'm getting hot just thinking. About, let me drink my detox. Mm-hmm. This is beautiful. Y'all better get into this. Pineapple water. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. So, um, before y'all jump on this bandwagon, you know, I know people like, <clears throat> sometimes I don't like to share my views like this because, you know, it comes with a lot, but it's, it's up and stuck today. It's up and stuck today. I am not a feminist. I don't believe I, I, that movement was not for us. It did not include us. It did not include black women, um, a brown women or indigenous women. It did not. It did not. And the fact that 40% of slave owners were white women, do you think that they want to include us? No, it's a hidden agenda. I believe this whole thing is a hidden agenda. I don't even think the agenda is hidden. I just think you got to you gotta kind of like dig for it. Sometimes it's right in plain sight. 60% of white women get abortions. That's stats today. 60%. So if they overturn this, now they ain't got, you got to have your baby. Like I told you, Handmaid's Tale. They're trying to get us out of here. Do you understand? Do you understand? I feel like it's a hidden agenda. I don't care what anybody say. Like, comment, subscribe, share. If you agree, yes, no, do or die. I don't know. Forehead and I am.